Harry, welcome to Celtic. Uh, what do you make of your new surroundings? Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of blown away. Um, I haven't been at a, at a, at a, at a, a huge club for a, for, a, for a while now, so this is all kind of new to me. And you know, it, it's, it's, it's nervous, you know, to come into a, such a huge club like this, to, to only see the facilities at the moment. Um, it's, it's, it's fantastic and, and the training ground set up is the perfect size so for me it, it's, it's been a brilliant first day. You'll get the players in next week uh, to work with them. How much are you looking forward to getting down to business? Really looking forward to uh, meeting the players first and foremost and then getting to understand uh, exactly their, their movement patterns and all that. Um, just sitting there even there with John for the last um, hour or so just talking about how they play. It's kind of similar. To, to, to my ideas, um, so working with the, the manager as well, it's going to be it's going to be great because the the ideas of what I like is is similar to what he likes. Tell us a bit about what what got you here. It's it's easy to just assume because you're an, an Aussie and our managers an Aussie that you've known each other all, all your lives. So what, how did you get here? Uh, well, it, it was funny enough. I was actually going in for an, another interview for another job, and I thought it went really well. And I was looking forward to the, the, the callback. He just had to do a, a few little uh, movements of, of something else. And in between that time, I actually had a call off uh, the manager. And the way he spoke to me, the way he presented the, the job, I said yes straight away. I didn't even worry about the, 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 the next part because I felt it was the opportunity to, for me to learn off not only a great manager, not only an Australian manager, but a great manager that has been and started to do his work into Europe and his ideas of what he wants to come across and he's, he's very forthright in what he wants out of his players. It's similar to what I like. And like I said, the way he spoke to me about football and the way that he wants, what he wants from me, I, I said virtually there straight away, of course I'll come. What we've got here at Celtic, of course, over the number of years is a winning mentality and, and and typified that with, with what he did in his first season last year. You obviously got that from a hugely successful playing career. Is that something that you hope to, to foster amongst the, the, the group here? Yeah, of course. Uh, he always likes to uh, mix things up. He always likes to bring in, in fresh ideas. And I said, when I spoke to him, like I didn't want to be just someone coming up here because of that Australian link. You know, he's he spoke very positive about He's been monitoring me for a while, and, and like I said, I never knew that. So, like I said, when he did speak to me about the ideas of what I can bring to the team, it was, like I said, a no-brainer. We're back in the Champions League group stage as well. You're a Champions League winner. How much are you looking forward to those big nights? <laughs> uh, it, they are special. Um, I, I don't think people can understand what it's like un unless you, you, you've, you've been there. And you can have that taste. But once you do have that taste, you want more. And you are competing against the best teams in the world. And yes, it is a cup competition. So you have to be at your very best to, to get far in the competition. And you have to have that little bit of uh, element of luck as well. So it's, it's going to be tough. But like I said, the, the way that uh, the manager's got his team playing, I think they're going to be a handful. What are your aims and ambitions then for the, the season ahead? Look, I, I've, I have strong ambitions. Uh, but I'm, I'm not going to lie, like I said, I've come into a huge club. I'm going to sit and I'm going to learn. I'm going to watch. I'm going to study. I'm going to see exactly what I can bring to the, the team. I'm not going to go straight in there and go this, this and this. That's not me. I, I want to learn because even just speaking there to John, John Kennedy, he's got so much experience that I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be just picking his, picking his brains left, right and centre. Did you watch any of our season last year when, when Ange came? Yeah, I, 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 watched, I watched the start of the season uh, and it, it, it wasn't great. But like I said, he's, he's, he's very meticulous in the way that he wants to play. And then you could just see the team grow over the season and it got stronger and stronger. You're always going to have that bad patch in the season. But like I said, I think he gives players a lot of confidence in the way that he plays that they go out there and they perform to their highest level. As someone who knows Ange from, from previous, previous clubs, can you... Can you understand why the fans have taken to him so much? Of, of course. I think uh, a lot of people take to Ange. Uh, well, to the, to, to, uh, a lot of people take to the manager because he, he plays a certain style of football that everybody wants to see and, and the top teams are playing it. 
You know, they, they, they want to play out from the back. They want to play through the middle. They want to create chances. They play that high tempo. As soon as they lose the ball, they want to be able to, to press, win the ball back in high areas, and then hopefully tire the team out and then dominate that way. And that's what people love to come and see, you know. Yes, you know, you, you, you do come across teams that are very rigid and they play a certain way, but football is very free-flowing, and he has that kind of idea of playing that way. Well, listen, from, from everyone here, we hope you have a really successful time. If you're successful, it means we're successful as well. So all the best, Harry. Thank you very much.